arrange their activity according to time and seasons right for example for example that hypnotic drug work more efficiently in winter than summer hypnotic drug work well in winter then summer this is example of season for example anti allergic drugs they will work more effectively after 1800 mean to say after 6 pm right so this this study is known as chrono pharmacology so till here we we look at on site of action the place where the drug have to show its effect we see mode of action effect which produced by a drug and at last we start the uh, sorry not start the left thing is mechanism of action mechanism of action nothing but important thing when on the receptor drug will come right when on the receptor the drug will come either <coughs> it is any mode of action either it is local mode of action direct indirect reversible irreversible uh, you are uh, selective non selective whatever when the on the receptor the drug will come then what will happen there will be some chemical reactions biochemical reactions between drug and receptor that is known as mode of action the biochemical changes right <coughs> or molecular changes or molecular event or biochemical event which lead to an effect i will write here bio chemical event between receptor and drug between receptor and drug which leads to an effect that is known as mode of action of the drug right so this is a just simple know how about pharmacodynamics in pharmacodynamics simply you have site of action mode of action mechanism of action site of action mainly we have receptor site right and receptor are your macro protein molecules which are present on the surface of the cells or inside the cells but some other some drugs may effect on cellular organelles like dna rna so etc some drugs may effect on the cellular cell membrane some drugs may effect on the tissues directly then we have mode of action mode of action means that the, the effect produced by a drug for example narcotic drugs can decrease the pain and can cause sedation uh, analgesic drugs can reduce the pain that will be effect of the drug so we have eight different ways by which a drug eight different ways by which a drug can produce its effect we have local mode of action the drug will directly effect on the tissues we have systemic mode of action the drug will produce effect with the help of blood then we have direct mode of action means the drug will directly effect on the receptor without any help indirect mode of action means the drug will effect on the receptor with the help of mediator the drug will not go to the receptor directly it will effect on some receptor and that receptor will work on the uh, at that mediator will work on the receptor then we have reversible mode of action these are also known as short term acting drugs mean to say that drug will effect on the receptor for short time and when the drug will excrete excrete from the body the receptor will start its problems again a problem is at start it was hyperactivated by using a drug it will become normal as the drug will excrete through the body it again uh, hyperactivated and irreversible mode of action is just vice versa of your uh, reversible mode of action right these are long term acting drugs when the drugs will excrete through the body the 
uh, effect will remain on the receptor next we have uh, selective mode of action mean to say that the drug will select its receptor okay non selective mode of action means the drug will not select its receptor the drug can uh, go on every kind of, of receptor then i give us uh, some touch here that is uh, chronopharmacology in chronopharmacology we will check the biorhythm right mean to say the drugs can change their activity according to according to season and according to time these are the two example of them and at last i discussed with you the mechanism of action of drug mechanism of action means the biochemical event between drug and receptor which leads to an effect so at last i i like to say you thank you so much because today we completed over 1000 subscriber thank you so much this is over today's data thank you so much so nice of you next uh, topic will be on pathology and the topic is death thank you so much take care goodbye